This video might reshape your perception of wormholes. Have you ever imagined a shortcut through space-time? Turns out, we can build a wormhole on Earth. But how? Will it have any catastrophic consequences? Can we travel through a wormhole in our lifetime? Buckle up, because the answers are not what you might expect. Get ready for an adventure that defies reality as we know it. In the vast tapestry of the cosmos, one enigmatic concept stands out. A cosmic shortcut known as a wormhole. Imagine a tunnel through space-time, a passage that could transcend the limitations of distance and time as we understand them. In this journey, we'll unravel the mysteries of wormholes, exploring their theoretical origins, their potential implications, and the tantalizing questions they pose to our understanding of the universe. Let's create a wormhole. Step 1. Quantum Field Manipulation the first step towards unraveling the secrets of creating a traversable wormhole is by manipulating the quantum field. In the quantum world, particles aren't solitary entities. They exist as manifestations of quantum fields that permeate all of space-time. These fields are dynamic, constantly undergoing fluctuations and interactions that give rise to the fundamental building blocks of matter and energy. This wave particle duality where particles exhibit both wave-like and particle-like behavior, is the essence of quantum mechanics. Central to quantum field manipulation is the notion of quantum vacuum fluctuations. Even in seemingly empty space, particles and antiparticles are spontaneously created and annihilated in a dance of energy governed by the uncertainty principle. These fleeting fluctuations exist on such minuscule scales that their effects are typically imperceptible, but their implications for energy manipulation are profound. Emerging from cutting-edge research in quantum optics and particle physics, scientists are exploring techniques to stimulate and amplify these vacuum fluctuations. By doing so, they aim to tap into the seemingly boundless energy potential inherent in the quantum vacuum. These explorations open the door to unconventional energy sources that challenge our current understanding of physics. At the heart of this, step's significance lies the prospect of localized negative energy density, an essential ingredient for the theoretical creation of a wormhole. Negative energy density contradicts our everyday experience, as it implies a state where energy content is below what we consider empty space. Theoretically, if harnessed and controlled, negative energy could stabilize the throat of a wormhole, preventing its collapse under the immense gravitational forces. Step 2. Exotic Matter Synthesis As we continue our voyage toward the hypothetical creation of a traversable wormhole, we delve into the intriguing world of exotic matter synthesis. This step delves into the speculative realm where theories of negative energy and particle physics intersect to create a substance that defies conventional understanding. Exotic matter, as the name suggests, is far from ordinary. It's characterized by its negative energy density, a concept that challenges the classical principles of physics. While exotic matter is only theoretical at this point, it plays a crucial role in the stabilization of a wormhole structure. The journey begins with a deep dive into particle physics, the study of the fundamental building blocks of matter and their interactions, the search for hypothetical particles or energy states that could possess negative energy density becomes paramount. Speculative candidates include particles with negative mass or energy, often referred to as phantom matter. The heart of this step involves the ambitious goal of synthesizing exotic matter. This entails creating localized regions of negative energy density, a process that remains a significant theoretical challenge. The manipulation of quantum fields, as explored in the previous step, may play a role in achieving this goal, harnessing the fluctuations of quantum vacuum on a scale that yields negative energy, remains a complex and uncharted endeavor. Step 3. Space-time Compression and Curvature our odyssey toward the theoretical creation of a wormhole now take a daring turn as we explore the intricate concepts of space-time compression and curvature. This step delves into the heart of general relativity, 
where the fabric of space-time itself is bent and manipulated to forge pathways through the cosmos. Imagine space-time as a flexible fabric shaped by massive objects and energy distributions. In this step, we contemplate the extraordinary idea of compressing and curving space-time to create a traversable passage, a potential shortcut across cosmic distances. At the core of this concept lies Alcubierre's warp drive hypothesis, a speculative framework that envisions space-time manipulation to achieve faster than light travel. Inspired by the gravitational lensing effects predicted by Einstein's theory, this idea involves bending space-time in front of a vessel while expanding it behind, creating a warp bubble. Creating a warp bubble necessitates the presence of exotic matter with negative energy density. The negative energy requirements play a vital role in shaping the curvature of space-time in a controlled and stable manner. While intriguing, this concept remains largely theoretical, and the manipulation of space-time on such scales remains a significant challenge. The manipulation of space-time curvature raises profound implications for the laws of physics as we understand them. It touches on questions of causality, energy conservation, and the very fabric of reality itself. Theoretical discussions often revolve around the potential for paradoxes and challenges posed by altering the fundamental structure of space-time. Step 4. Wormhole Throat Stabilization Our voyage into the hypothetical realm of wormhole creation brings us to a critical juncture, stabilizing the very throat of the wormhole itself. In this step, we delve into the intricate interplay of gravitational forces, exotic matter, and the delicate balance required to maintain the stability of this cosmic conduit. Imagine the wormhole as a tunnel, with an entrance, a tunnel-like passage, and an exit. The throat is the narrowest part of this passage, where the curvature of space-time is most extreme. Stabilizing this throat is paramount to prevent the wormhole from collapsing under its own gravitational forces. Exotic matter, with its negative energy density, takes center stage once again. Theoretical models suggest that carefully placed exotic matter could counteract the gravitational forces attempting to crush the throat. By harnessing negative energy, a delicate equilibrium can be achieved, preventing the wormhole from closing prematurely. Step 5. Navigation and Temporal Lensing In our quest to comprehend the creation of a traversable wormhole, we now venture into the fascinating territory of navigation and temporal lensing. This step explores how travelers might navigate these cosmic bridges and grapple with the mind-bending effects of time dilation. As you imagine traversing a wormhole, consider the challenges of finding your way through the convoluted pathways of space-time. The immense curvature, gravitational forces, and potential twists and turns within the wormhole demand innovative navigation strategies. Enter the realm of quantum entanglement, a phenomenon that connects particles in such a way that changes to one instantaneously affect the other, regardless of distance. Scientists speculate that harnessing entanglement might enable real-time communication and navigation across vast cosmic gaps, allowing travelers to probe and chart the path ahead. However, this theoretical navigation approach presents its own challenges. Quantum entanglement is delicate and prone to disruptions. Controlling and maintaining entanglement over vast distances and through the unstable environment of a wormhole could be a formidable task. Temporal lensing adds another layer of complexity to wormhole travel. The intense gravitational forces near the entrance and exit points could lead to time dilation, a phenomenon where time passes at different rates depending on one's position. Traveling through a wormhole might result in time dilation effects making time travel and causality, considerations an integral part of the journey. Step 6. Causality and Temporal Paradoxes As our journey through the theoretical creation of a wormhole continues, we encounter a realm of profound implications, causality and temporal paradoxes. In this step, we delve into the mind-bending concepts of time loops, causality violations, and the very fabric of reality itself. 
Imagine arriving at your destination through a traversable wormhole, only to find that events seem to unfold out of sequence. The concept of causality, the fundamental principle that cause precedes effect, becomes muddled as you grapple with the potential for time loops and paradoxes. Temporal paradoxes, such as the famous grandfather paradox, challenge our understanding of cause and effect. Consider the scenario where a traveler enters a wormhole and emerges at a point in the past. Could they inadvertently change the course of history in ways that defy logic? The presence of a traversable wormhole opens up the possibility of closed time-like curves, where an event loops back in time and affects its own past. These loops introduce a level of complexity that raises questions about free will, the nature of time, and the structure of the universe. Theoretical frameworks suggest that mechanisms might exist to prevent paradoxes, such as the chronology protection conjecture, which posits that the laws of physics inherently prevent causal violations. Yet, the very existence of these mechanisms and their implications remain topics of intense debate. Scientists working towards creating a wormhole is essentially following this guide, in a vast scale of course. But the idea behind creating a wormhole stays the same. But have scientists made a wormhole in the lab? Not quite. What physicists did was organize the basic components of a quantum computer into a specific quantum state. They were then able to transfer information from one part of the computer to another. Through the quantum system, the quantum system and the way the information was transferred can be described using a particular model in physics. According to this model, the kind of information transfer that occurred within the computer is descriptively similar to the way that something passes through a wormhole. Now, imagine if we made an actual wormhole on Earth. What would happen to us? Will it be catastrophic? Creating a stable and traversable wormhole would likely lead to some dangers. The energy needed to stabilize the wormhole's throat and prevent its collapse could have catastrophic effects on the surrounding environment. It could potentially lead to massive disruptions, earthquakes, and other natural disasters. The manipulation of space-time required to create a wormhole might introduce unpredictable instabilities in our local space-time fabric. This could cause distortions, disruptions of communication systems, and unpredictable shifts in the fabric of reality. Ormholes involve the bending of space-time to a significant degree. This could result in extreme gravitational forces near the entrance and exit points of the wormhole, leading to severe tidal forces that could tear apart structures and cause widespread damage. The presence of a traversable wormhole could lead to violations of causality, allowing for the creation of time loops and paradoxes. Events might occur out of sequence, making it challenging to predict outcomes or understand the consequences of actions. The creation of a wormhole could raise profound ethical and philosophical questions. The potential for catastrophic events, altered realities, and disruptions of the natural order could have far-reaching implications for the well-being of humanity. Manipulating space-time on such a scale could have ripple effects throughout the universe. Altering the fabric of space and time could disrupt cosmic structures, affect the behavior of other celestial objects, and potentially lead to unintended consequences on a cosmic scale. Now, let's imagine a fun idea. What will happen to you if you enter the wormhole? As you enter the wormhole, you might experience a sensation of space being compressed around you. The wormhole could create a shortcut through space allowing you to travel vast distances in a shorter time than traditional methods. Inside the wormhole, space-time itself would be curved and distorted. You might feel as though you're navigating a tunnel, like structure with bending walls. The intense gravitational forces near the entrance and exit points of the wormhole could lead to time dilation effects. Time might pass differently for you compared to those outside the wormhole. You might experience time at a different rate, potentially leading to time travel scenarios. Depending on the nature of the wormhole, you might encounter causality paradoxes. Events could occur out of sequence, leading to situations where the concept of cause and effect becomes blurred. Upon exiting the wormhole, 
you could find yourself in a completely different region of space, potentially light years away from your starting point. The exit point could be in a distant part of the universe, or even in a different universe altogether, depending on the wormhole's characteristics. Navigating a wormhole would likely present physical challenges due to gravitational forces, space-time curvature, and potential interactions with exotic matter. Ensuring your safety and well-being during the journey would be a significant concern. So, how far are we to creating a wormhole? The theory says it is very much possible, but the constraint is the energy required. As a very rough approximation, you would need the energy the sun produces over 100 million years to make a wormhole about the size of a coin. The time required to collect that much negative energy is very far from today. It might take humanity decades of technological advancements before we will be able to do it. Although some physics says traversable wormholes are improbable, physicists haven't yet proven that they're impossible. The mysteries of wormholes remind us of the boundless nature of human curiosity and the ever-evolving frontiers of science. We've explored concepts that challenge the very fabric of space-time, inviting us to contemplate the limits of our understanding and the potential of humanity's future explorations. Thank you for joining us on this journey. If you found this exploration as captivating as we have, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to Asrenovium for more mind-expanding content that delves into the depths of the universe's mysteries.